Hi everyone, it's Jane Aurebiani and here we are going to do a VD thorax, so thorax on there. We know we want our patient on their back and we want them nicely in the middle of our image and remember that we're looking at just below where the legs are for the shoulders and we're doing many last stands again, so manubrium, last rib, skin surfaces. How am I going to stop my patient rotating? Uh, we could use a trough and particularly put the hind limbs in that, stop some rotating. I actually quite like, because the patient's quite light, I quite like using sandbags on the side of the head. Ideally it would be the shoulders, but we know that his shoulders are a little bit... We know that his shoulders are a little bit raised, so you can see, I'll put the light on at the end. Also, I'm double, doubling up the sandbags so they're double height, so that's going to help reduce rotation as well. He's not going to spin over the top. This is a huge lot of sandbag. And again, rather like it is when you do the VD, you don't want to just get a sandbag and wedge it along the side of the patient. Oh, he's slightly out of kilter. That's a little bit better, so we want him to look a little bit straighter. And then we need to collimate, manubrium, last rib. And when you do this one, bear in mind that you'll, he's going to throw a little bit of shadow. So there is space for labelling here, but it is actually under the shadow, but it's still going to be a beam and it's not going to be the area of importance. So let me turn the light on and I will quickly whiz you round and show you. So we've got labelling, we've got sandbag, we've got sandbag, sandbag, sandbag. Thanks for watching.